of the things we hope to accomplish in this community, especially pertaining to young men, is to create an equitable community for all people. Regardless of your background or where you come from, we're interested in where you're going. We decided to focus on the young male population in Detroit because that's a part of the community that is definitely underserved. We do a lot pertaining to mentorship. We actually give every young man who come here a mentor, give them an opportunity to find out what their gifts and talents are, give them also an opportunity to be able to express that and then provide the resources to help them get there. That's why we like One Detroit. We actually really do get the, the whole story in One Detroit. Even when we did the first story, which was the story of the young men of the church, even though that aired about five or six minutes, it captured the essence of what we wanted to. So uh, I must admit, y'all got some pretty good editors. Our company, uh, Pad Genius, we do home security as well as home automation. We take your traditional security services um, and we, we elevate that um, by adding the home automation piece as well. It was an extremely moving episode and, and we knew immediately um, that some way, somehow, we wanted to, to get involved with the church. It was a young man on there by the name of Dwight who was discussing uh, some of the issues he was having just as being a, a black young male, him and his, his three children, I and mean, some of the adversities that he faced simply by just being a black male. As a black young man and, and being a little older, but understanding what some of those issues may be, that really hit home for me. When we reached out, we came out, we did the free security system um, for them. We also explored and wanted to see how we can further help get involved with some of the youth movement pretty much that was going on around here. Where could you hide and where could you be where somebody would not suspect you were there? Right there for sure. That's we are choosing to come to Detroit because for one, there is a, a great need. Few volunteers with a lot of work that needs to be done. And so we want to be able to play our part, not only in helping securing the neighborhoods, um, but also from a uh, growth standpoint, from a volunteer and mentorship standpoint. We want to be able to take the knowledge, um, entrepreneurial skills that we, we currently have ingrained in us and to be able to, to transfer those skills uh, to some of these young men and women who are looking for a way and need those talents drawn from within them. One of the things I hope to achieve over this next year is to be able to get uh, some more young men and women in this community engaged, to be able to expose them to a trade that maybe they've never considered before, expose them just to our business um, in general, to see if we can garner any interest, um, as well as get the community involved with input, as well as hire from within the community to work on this project and possibly future projects.